pennies is a penny. And in the next seven days, I will be changing this into $1,000 to buy kids back to school shoes. It is now day two. Yesterday, I managed to turn a penny into $50 and beat up Ultra Boost that we have not been able to sell yet. And we're not at Plato's Closet. We're gonna try to buy some sneaker heat for 50 bucks. Oh wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. You got some Jordan 11s for 150. Are these like all the mint sneakers right here? Oh, over here? Yeah, there's some over here and then they're pretty much just around the, the store. Okay. Some of them are on the back and then over there. Okay, it looks like we got like some Adidas boosts right here. Some KDs. These are in like a gently used condition though. 60 bucks, bro. $10 off what I have. I need to find something cheap like this. I want like a really, really good pair of shoes that I could like resell. I seen $35 for them in a size eight. I don't think we're gonna be able to resell these either. Should we go to another Play-Dohs? Bad news. Either we need more money or we need to figure out how we can buy some more heat sneakers for cheap. I think we're gonna have to go to like, I would say either Ross or thrift stores. I think we might have to go trip to the thrift. Thrift town, baby. And there it is, baby. The wall of all walls. We need the cheapest steals for the most heat. Let me see, let me see. What do we got, what do we got, what do we got, what do we got? What do we got? <gasps> Nothing. There is, uh, there's absolutely uh, nothing worth uh, selling for uh, 100 bucks. Yeah. Oh, man. There really is not um, any shoes in here. Dude, I just like, I don't know how I'm gonna do it to go from a penny to $1,000, but that's my goal. And we're gonna keep grinding. We're not gonna stop until we make it happen. <sighs> Next door. Thrift land. Haven't been here in years. Damn, it's a long line. Who's she talking to? I just have my. I don't know. We're just uh, doing a vlog. A vlog? A vlog, like a video log, like Jake Paul, like Team 10? Yeah, here of the store. Yeah. No? Okay. No worries, no problem. I'm just gonna look real quick. Nothing at all. I'm gonna prank Joel and tell him that I found something crazy though. Bro, roll down the window. Roll down the window. Bro, bro, bro. I think our luck changed. Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, there's literally, dude, there's some freaking Jordan 11s, bro, no for 30 way. bucks on the shelf. I'm not even kidding. They're like behind the counter. Bro, well, we'll but I want to, dude. Bro. Shoot. Bro, go record that. Go get the shoe. Nah, I'm just messing with you, bro. There's nothing. There's oh literally nothing. God. It was trash. It was trash. Come on, give us some J's. Give us some J's. Give us some J's. Oh, we got some Air Maxes right off the bat, boys. Yo, peep these, bro. Damn, these are huge, though. Yellow, $38 only, bro? Only $38. Dude, and they're size 14, that's the only thing. But they look like they're in great condition. Size 14 is the only thing, bro. Yo, they have off-white Air Forces back there. They actually have off-whites here. We got some Prestos in here. Dude, these are another massive size, but they're only $38. Size 13, though, they look brand new. Dude, this is the cheapest, this is cheaper than the thrift stores. <sighs> I just wish there was something like fire fire, bro. Like something that we could like actually sell. These are massive, bro. Why does everybody here have big feet, bro? <laughs> oh, you're on the big size, that's why. Oh, we are on the big size. I'm thinking we look around a little bit more. I feel like they might have something special in here. Oh, these are <laughs> these are nothing, never mind. What about like in the girls section? Let's see if they got sneaker heat over here. Uh, I'm not seeing anything. These are like knockoffs. These are like knockoff uh, Versace's. Definitely no value here. We're gonna keep searching though. We got some 270s in here. These seem to be a pretty good size. Eight and a half, thirty-nine dollars. Not the, not bad. <sighs> I feel like we need to come up on something crazy, bro. Here they are, eight hundred, and online they're fifteen hundred. They had some off whites for fifteen hundred dollars. If we can manage to make eight hundred dollars, we could buy those and potentially flip our money right off the bat. But that's gonna have to be way later in the series. We're gonna have to see what happens, boys. After four hours, someone had agreed to meet up with me to buy the Ultra Boost. Hi, how are you? Just selling? Yes, these are the shoes real quick. Take 10? 10? I literally just need 20 real quick. Okay. We just, here you go. Oh my, thank you so much. Yes, they're all yours. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Thank you to ExpressVPN for sponsoring today's video. Guys, we're in 2022. If you aren't using a VPN, you're missing out. After going to every single location all around Austin today, this seems like it's our last hope, guys. From unlocking some of your favorite shows on Netflix to protecting your personal data, we could all use a VPN. We have $50 and the 20 that we made from the Ultra Boost. I just pray that we're able to find something here to keep us going. So why not use the number one best rated VPN by top news sources like Forbes, Rolling Stone, and Tech Radar. Just come out. All right. We're in here. Welcome, man. Thank you. 
ExpressVPN also lets you change your location online. Do you want to watch South Park on Netflix? Here's what you do. Open the ExpressVPN and connect to the United Kingdom. Now refresh Netflix and search South Park. You are now able to binge and watch the whole season. Since I was in Mexico for a whole four days, I needed my entertainment, but YouTube TV would not let me play unless I was in America. Last and final destination. They do have a lot of shoes, but I'm just so discouraged at this point. I feel like we're literally not gonna find anything. I just used ExpressVPN on my recent trip to Cabo to connect to the United States to watch YouTube TV. Find out how you can get three months of ExpressVPN for free by clicking expressvpn.com slash legit Tim or clicking the link in the description box below. Protect yourself and your internet search history. Download ExpressVPN today. Here are the men's shoes and it is not looking good so far. It's not looking good at all. <sighs> There's literally nothing. I knew it was going to happen like this. I'm wondering if we should just like not upload this series, bro. We might not be able to like continue with the challenges. <gasps> yo! Yo, 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 They're selling these for only this price. It's the biggest deal of the year. Oh my gosh. Legit Nation for a whopping $65. We have a dollar and seven cents left. The fine of the century. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Drum roll, please. Ladies and gentlemen, the Black Cat Air Jordan 4s released so many years ago at Play-Doh's Closet, boys, for $65. If you know, you know. They did not know what these were. This is the ultimate come up. The ultimate steal, the ultimate W, baby, Black Cat 4s for $65. Oh my gosh, this is freaking insane, dude. All right, Texas Shoe Exchange North, here we are. We're gonna see if we can try to sell these, see if they're willing to trade for something. I just wanna see if they're legit, honestly. I hope that we didn't buy fakes because the challenge will literally be ruined. What's up, Joe? Hey, bro, so check this out. I got something rare and exclusive for y'all today, man. Some black ass. You yes, sir. Anymore, you don't see them anymore at all, bro. Everybody's always asking for these. Really? If you would have had these for back to school. They would have sold like that. Yeah. Are you serious? Every, number one shoe we could ask for. So look, I'm trying to do a challenge today, bro, where I trade my, I work my way up. Uh, we started off with a penny, ended up with some black cats. I'm trying to buy kids who don't have back to school shoes, shoes at the end of the video. So it's like this challenge video. So I wanted to come in here and see if by any chance you guys were interested in purchasing or trading like something else for them. Money would help out the most. Where'd you get them from? Uh, <laughs> so you're not gonna believe okay, it if I told you. If I tell you, if I tell you where I got them, you're not gonna believe it, bro. I found them in a Plato's closet. Plato's closet? Yes, right down the street. I believe it, man. These went on sale back in the day. Dude, they were only for like 65 bucks, dude. That's good. That's a good price. But I know you could sell them here for a lot more than 65. So what could you do for these today? Are they legit, first of all? They're legit. They're real. I'd probably offer them like 300 cash for them. 300? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Bro, that would help this series out like crazy. 300 cash right now. $300. Yo, let's do it, bro. Let's do it. I'm down. Let's do it. Are you serious, dude? One, two, three. Dude, just like that. I appreciate it, bro. Always show love to Texas Shoe Exchange North, man. This puts us way ahead of the game. It's time to keep grinding. We're going to turn this into a thousand bucks by the end of the series, so keep watching.